hello everyone you are welcome how to solve and find the value of this beautiful math problem without using any calculator and without any standard multiplication so how can we solve this math problem here first of all we will try to find out and change this 81 to its exponential form so therefore we can write this 81 as this can be written as 3 times 3 which is 9 9 times 3 is 27 and 27 times 3 is 81 so here 3 is 4 times so we can write this as 3 is to power 4 so the exponential form of 81 is 3 is to power 4 so here we will replace 81 with this value 3 is to power 4 so this will become is equal to 81 is 3 is to power 4 or is to power 4 minus this is 3 is to power 4 or is to power 3 here in both the terms we will use an exponential identity r is to power m or is to power n so here in both terms we will use this one exponential identity r is to power m or is to power n which can also be written as r is to power m times n so using this identity here you will multiply the powers with each other so this will become 3 is to power let's multiply the power so 4 times power is 16 minus and this will become 3 is to power 4 times 3 is 12 and we will try to make these two numbers the same so for that we will do some changes in this one forward so therefore we can write this first term first number as 3 is to power 16 16 can be written as 12 plus 4 minus 3 is to power 12 and in this one number we will use another exponential identity r is to power m plus n identity so here we will use this one identity r is to power m plus n which can also be written as r is to power m times n is to power n so using this identity here this term will become this will become 3 is to power 12 times 3 is to power 4 minus 3 is to power 12 look into both the terms and put the term this 3 is to power 12 is common so let us take out this 3 is to power 12 common from both the terms so this will become taking 3 is to power 12 common so here three, only 3 is to power 4 is left minus here only 1 is left now here we can write this 3 is to power 12 as this will can be written as 6 times 2 which is 12 times and here the value of 3 is to power 4 is simply 81 so we will replace this with 81 so this will become 81 minus 1 now here in this one number we will use this one identity and we will change this number from this one form to this one form so this will become 3 is to power 6 whole square times and here 81 minus 1 gives him simply 80 now here we will try to find out the value of 3 is to power 6 we have, we have to change this to a number form so therefore we can write 3 is to power 6 as this can be written as 3 is to power 4 plus 2 so using this one identity here we can write this as 3 is to power 4 times 3 is to power 2 now the value of 3 is to power 4 is simply we calculated it it is 81 so this will become 81 times and 3 square is simply 9 so let's multiply these two numbers so this is very simple 9 times 1 is 9 and 9 times 8 is 72 so this gives him 729 so the value of 3 is to power 6 is 729 so let's replace this value 3 to power 6 with this value so this number will become the value of 3 to power 6 is 729 whole square times 80 now here we can find out this value using an algebraic identity we can add this 729 as the sum of 700 plus 29 whole square then we can use a plus b whole square identity but here i will try to find out this value with another method so therefore we can write this as this is in square form so we can write this as 729 
times 729 times this one 80 so next we can write these numbers as 729 will be the same and here we can write this as the sum of 700 plus 20 plus 9 times 80 now here we will close these two numbers in braces here we will multiply this 729 with these three numbers so first we will multiply this number with 700 so let's multiply this number with 700 to multiply this number with 700 we will start from the ones position 729 times 0 is 0 729 times 0 is 0 729 times 7 is we have to multiply this number with 7 so let's multiply 7 with this number 7 times 9 is 63 so this will become 3 6 is carried 7 times 2 is 14 14 plus 6 is 20 so this will become 0 2 is carried 7 times 7 is 49 49 plus 2 is 51 so this gives him 510,300 so the product of these two numbers gives him this one number now let's multiply this number with 20 so again this number times 0 is 0 and this number times 2 is 2 times 9 is 18 so this will become 8 1 is carried 2 times 2 is 4 4 plus 1 is 5 and 2 times 7 is 14 so here the product of this number with 20 gives him 14580 plus now let's multiply this number with 9 so 9 times 9 is 81 so this will become 1 8 is carried 9 times 2 is 18, 18 plus 8 is 26. So this is 6, 2 is carried, 9 times 7 is 63, 63 plus 2 is 65. So this gives him 6,261. Braces close times 80. Now let us add these three numbers and then we we'll multiply the result with 80. Now to add these three numbers we will start from the ones position. So let's start from the ones position. 1 plus 0 plus 0 is 1 6 plus 8 is 14 14 plus 0 is 14 so 4 1 will be carried to this number sorry this is not 2 this is 5 because 9 times 7 is 63 63 plus carried to is 65 so this is 5 now 5 plus 1 is 6 6 plus 5 is 11 11 plus 3 is 14 so 4 1 will be carried to the next digit 6 plus 1 is 7 7 plus 4 is 11 11 plus 0 is 11 so 1 1 will be carried to this one digit 1 plus 1 is 2 2 plus 1 is 3 so this is 3 and this part will be the same so here the sum of these three numbers gives him 531,441 times this one number 80 now finally we have to multiply these two numbers so again it is very easy here this number times 0 is 0 and this number times 8 is we have to multiply this number with 8 so let's multiply 8 with this number from the ones position so 8 times 1 is 8 8 times 4 is 32 so this is 2 3 will be carried now 8 times 4 is 32 32 plus 3 is 35 so this will become 5 3 will be carried now 8 times 1 is 8 8 plus 3 is 11 so this will become 1 1 will be carried no 8 times 3 is 24, 24 plus 1 is 25, so this is again 5, and 2 is carried, no, 8 times 5 is 40, 40 plus 2 is 42, so this gives him 42, so here the product of these two numbers gives him 42,515,280, so finally 42,515,280, is our answer and value of this interesting exponential math problem.